The City of Del Mar selected Kleinfelder to be the prime consultant for the evaluation of a major bridge structure, the North Torrey Pines Road Bridge at the southern end of their city. The bridge had a number of challenges with it that it, it had to, that had to be addressed. It had severe corrosion problems and deterioration. It was constructed in 1933 on the coast. It also had significant seismic deficiencies that w raised a concern that the bridge could collapse in a seismic event. The City of Del Mar selected Kleinfelder to address all of these issues in a very active community environment on a structure that was eligible for listing on the National Historic Register. We brought a team to the City of Del Mar to evaluate all of these issues, all of these challenges, and all of these unique situations that had to be combined for a successful project in the end. Initially, the project was estimated to be about $40 million. It could have been a replacement structure, it could have been a rehabilitation. Kleinfelder took on a very aggressive study of the existing bridge to determine what our options were. We did extensive field work of corrosion evaluations, chloride contents, evaluating the condition of the bridge. We did very unique uh, analysis techniques to determine whether we could save the existing bridge, address the deterioration problems, and address the seismic deficiencies. Ultimately, the solution was a hybrid. The solution ended up being a full replacement of the superstructure, the horizontal element. We found that that was too deteriorated to save. The columns of the bridge were corroded. However, we found that they were something that we could save on the bridge. We skinned the, the, the outside concrete off of the, off of the columns, put new confining steel in for seismic conditions, and ultimately then put the surface finish back on as you see it. We paid a great amount of attention and detail to all of the features and dimensions of the bridge so that ultimately this bridge looks nearly identical in almost every way to the existing structure. You can see the board form finish that we recreated, the, the railing that is very similar to the original bridge, and all of the dimensions being so similar, it's hard to tell the difference from this bridge to the original structure. So while the superstructure looks identical to the replaced superstructure, it performs quite differently in the seismic sense. The existing structure was multiple simple spans on short seats that would have fallen off or collapsed during a seismic event. Uh, the solution that we brought to the table for that event was that we, we did precast the superstructure. It was placed very similarly to the original structure, but we included post-tensioning through the entire superstructure to make it continuous isolated the superstructure from the substructure to prevent those seismic forces from damaging the existing substructure and taking all those forces into the abutment. It was a very unique solution that required a peer review by seismic et experts in the state of California to confirm that that was indeed a very valid and, and, and good solution for this bridge. At this point we have a structure that will easily last the next 50 years doubling its original intended life and matching in appearance and color and shape and features almost identically the structure that was there before.